Danos' capture by U.S. intelligence effectively marks the end of the incident in Indonesia, securing for the Timorese. Intelligence has confirmed Suwadi Sadano's connections to so-called Golden Triangle heroin, as agreed to a U.S. military presence in East Timor as defined by Timorese government. This beginning of what the Bowers administration hopes will cannot underestimate the cost of democracy, nor overestimate the costs of the alternative. The echelon match from the airport security cameras only had a 2% margin of error. So this is our last pox box. The soft decompresses it. Our first cycle of infection will be in the thousands and nearly impossible to quarantine. What does Soth get out of it? Sedano's already finished. And what else? He's already got the device on site. We spook him in the slightest and he sets it off. It's down to you, Fisher. Your ride is just about here. A cargo truck that should get you through security and into LAX. I've arranged for a small distraction. If it comes together, it should open a small window of opportunity. You make my job too easy. Just respecting my elders. And if anybody sees you, you've lost your ride and the mission's over before it begins. You've always had a talent for the obvious, Lambert. until the next point. And if I know, just found it in my task register. Huh. Probably some TSA bigwig trying to get promoted. Something strange going on today. It's like there's an orange alert they don't want to tell anybody about. That's weird. I'll see you around. Yeah, take it easy. LAX. You're kidding. That was way too easy. Basically, we've got gaps in the armor. And you're not the only visitor that slipped through. Soth. And the last ND-133, and a handful of hired mercenaries disguised as LAX employees. I'd be willing to bet they're still fresh from a smallpox vaccination, so you may be able to ID them by their higher-than-normal body temperature. We have no choice. We need to have them dead.
rest of the mission. We have no choice. We need to have them dead. Stupid dog. Great. Grim, you got anything on how they're communicating? Yeah, it's an ultra-wide band, local network, node-based. They've got ten members online, including Soth. Then we're looking at nine terrorists you're going to need to neutralize before you find Soth. If all of Soth's men have been vaccinated for smallpox within the last ten days, then it's a safe bet they're running a few degrees hotter. Is somebody there? Nice Larian. What? I like your Larian. Oh, thanks. Are you new here? I don't think I've seen you around before. Hell? Should I tell somebody about that? We've got a terrorist radio alert. Oh, thanks. Are you new here? I don't think I've seen you around before. No, just new to the shift. Ah, usually part of the graveyard shift. Yeah. Then you must know J.M. Terry. Listen, I gotta get back to work. Oh, sorry about that. Got a tendency to gab. Take it easy. Placement. Yep. Great. I hate to say it, but Bob was a little too thirsty for his own good. That's not good. <laughs> That's not good.
Fisher, we have additional intel. It seems they have two more terrorists who have infiltrated the waiting zone in the office area. Fisher, you cannot leave any terrorists behind. This will jeopardize the rest of the mission. I gotta step out for a second. No problem. I can cover things here. Just me. Have you seen Martin? No, I think something's going really wrong. No kidding. 
I was supposed to meet him up top. Cover the bus before we pull out. That's not good. Of course, ma'am. Of course. No, that's not what I meant. I didn't mean to suggest that at all. If you could just tell me your original destination. I understand that. I understand that. I'm not arguing that with you, ma'am. If you could tell me your original destination, maybe... Of course, ma'am. Albuquerque. But unless you tell me... Yes, Albuquerque. I'm not arguing that with you. Albuquerque. Listen, the other line is green. Could I... Sorry. Sorry. I understand that, and I'm trying to... Just a second. Hey, you want to give me a hand with the phones? I'm sorry, I'm very busy. Just five minutes, pal. Come on, I was supposed to get off half an hour ago. Listen, who's your supervisor? I'll put in a good word for you. Um, Jones. Jones? Jones who? Ed Jones. I have to go. I'm very busy. Wait, what's your name? I'll... Sorry. If you could just tell me your original destination... Of course, ma'am. Albuquerque. I understand that. I understand that. Sorry. Boss? If you can read me, my cover may have been compromised. I need instruction. Are you there? I can kill the clerk quietly before he has the chance to alert anybody. I don't have much time. I'm taking action. Repeat, I'm killing the clerk. Good work, Fisher. That takes care of all but Soth's men. And the chatter looks like they're with Soth. We're nearly certain he's in the catwalks above passenger ticketing. Work your way up there and find him. Neutralize him and the others and retrieve the ND-133. I suggest we go for a short break. Forcing the controls again will cause massive traffic problems with no solution.
location where Soth could be. He seems to have entered the ticketing area just below you. Fisher, we need confirmation on this. Locate Soth in the ticketing area. We need to ID him. The leg story again. I might be too far away. Fisher, spot Soth in the area below using your thermal and binoculars. They've got you on camera. That means an alarm. And that means Soth releases the pox. This is pure madness. Reinforcing the controls again will cause massive traffic problems with no solution. We have an indication where Soth could be. He seems to have entered the ticketing area just below you. Fisher, spot Soth in the area below using your thermal and binoculars. Okay, we've got him. Affirmative. He's carrying the last ND-133 box. Exit. There's a crawl space that will let you up onto the catwalks. Get to it. We don't have much time. Flights, we've discussed this. Right, right. What about our Midway and Vegas flights? I don't want to release until they're disembarked. Yes, but are they off the plane yet? Excellent. Only a few minutes now. Out. This really doesn't look like an accident to me. The security guys already looked at it. You'd need a cold chisel to shear these bolts off like this. Whatever, let's just get it fixed. I'm off in an hour and I'm not looking for any overtime.
but don't slow down. We're only a few minutes from I don't know how many thousands of dead. Get the ND-133. I've got the box. We still have 11 minutes on the timer. Damn, damn, damn! That's five less than we were counting on. Even my Osprey, we couldn't get it safely out of LA city limits. We need something to seal it in. It would have to be reinforced steel to withstand the force of decompression. We'll evacuate the airport. That should keep casualties below a thousand. Fisher, maybe you can get low fast. If the box decompresses inside some kind of containment in the basement, we may be able to get casualties down to the dozens. I've got a better idea. 